Saints in two. Saint Theodosius of Chernigov. Saint Theodosius was born in the 17th century to the priest Nikita and Maria. The saint was taught Christian piety that remained with him throughout his life. From childhood, he was distinguished by a fervent love for God and the zeal for the church. Growing in spiritual maturity near the relics of Saints Anthony and Theodosius and other God pleasers of the Key of Caves, he tried to imitate their holy life as much as he could. He devoted all of his free time to prayer, meditation on God, and the reading of holy scriptures. Upon receiving his education, he received monastic tonsure at the Key of Lavra with the name Theodosius in honor of St. Theodosius of the Caves. He was made an archdeacon and soon after a priest. In 1662, St. Theodosius was appointed a gumen of the Corson Monastery in Kiev, which was in complete ruin. Thanks to his energy and initiative, the monastery was quickly restored. He was particularly concerned with the order of church services. He formed an excellent choir, which was famed not only in Little Russia, but also in Moscow. St. Theodosius sent his singers to Moscow to instruct their choirs in the Kievan chant. St. Theodosius had to live through difficult days, enduring many sorrows and slanders. He was also one of the main representatives of the Sea of Kiev and helped reunite Kiev with the Russian Orthodox Church. St. Theodosius was consecrated a bishop in September of 1692 in the Dormition Cathedral in the Moscow Kremlin. The saint worked to raise the level of true Christian piety of his flock, and he also focused on maintaining older monasteries and founding of new communities. The saint devoted much attention to the clergy, and he tried to choose worthy candidates for the priesthood and encourage pastoral education. Strict uprightness in regard to clergy and flock, deep compassion, concern, and Christian love of peace were distinguished features in the activity of the saint. Not only did the Orthodox turn to him for help and advice, but also persons of other confessions. St. Theodosius did not remain with his Chernigov flock very long, sensing his approaching death. St. Theodosius died on February 5th of 1696. His successor, St. John Maximovich, who was healed of a grave illness by St. Theodosius, later placed a stone plaque over his grave with a poetic inscription in gratitude for the saint's help. The glorification of St. Theodosius occurred on September 9th, 1896.